So apparently, um, Drake and Twenty One Savage were supposed to drop an album tomorrow. Oh yeah, yeah, but it got pushed back due to their producer um, catching COVID. Dang. So they say next week. Next week. Yeah, I'm anticipating that. That shit's probably fire. Yeah, I fuck with the shit that they uh, got together so far. I fuck with it. Yeah, they got a nice catalog together so far. I like the way they blend. Isn't he signed to Drake, or he was at least? I don't know. Or potentially? I don't know. He might just be associated with him. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know what? He could sign to OVO if he wanted to. If he didn't. Yeah, that'd be a good move. Yeah, it would. That'd be a good ass move. What about that uh, Glorilla <laughs> and that Cardi B? You, Glorilla might be the fucking uh, female artist of the year. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's the song of the year. Yeah, that beat, yo. Yeah, that shit addictive. Yeah, that beat is hard. I heard that song so many times, it ain't even played out yet. Yeah, that's the that's song of the year. Ain't nothing fucking with that right now. Yeah, you think she the, uh, the best rapper out now, a female? Yeah, I think she's going to be the uh, female artist of the year. She deserved that. Yeah. Yeah. Everything she dropped in the hit. Everything. She ain't missed yet. No? Mm-mm. Yeah, um, who you think she's assigned to or she signed? She signed to Gotti. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's signed right. Gotti. That's a that's good a, move. That's a Memphis thing. That's the Memphis uh, movement. Yeah, um, they should... Um, she just opened a whole new door for the females down there. They should um do a feature with um 3-6 Mafia. Hmm. <clears throat> Glorilla and 3-6, yo? Yeah, you know, uh, Gotti and Three Six had a, a bad kind of history. Oh, do they? Yeah, it's squash now, but I don't know if they do no music together. I'm not sure. Yeah, I guess time will tell. Yeah, how you feel about uh, Cardi verse on that? Uh, that shit's fire. Cardi snapped, didn't she? Definitely, she Cardi, did. Cardi, Cardi improving. Yes, yeah, she is. I've you been th- feeling Cardi recently. You think she writing? Yeah. Now? Yeah, she back back in our bag. Yeah, that shit's fire, yo. Yeah. I'm like, when I heard that, I'm like, see, when you hear a new artist, you're like, yeah, this shit's fire. Yeah. But when you hear an artist that's been out and been relevant and give you something like that, you pay more attention to it. Yeah, it's nothing better than an artist that keep improving. Do you think um, she only hit spit that fire-ass verse because of what she was up against? Or do you think she's really improving like that? I just think she ain't our bag. Yeah? I just think she ain't our bag. Um, I'd like to see Cardi feature with a lot of people, you know? Who you would like to see a feature with? I'd like to see a Cardi B and Eminem feature. Yeah, that, that'd that make sense. That'd be dope. That'd make sense. Definitely. Because he don't, he don't feature with too many females. Nah. He stays with like Skylar Gray. Rihanna. Yeah, like uh, Gwyneth Stefani. Yeah. Sia. Them pop artists. Yeah. What's up with a female rapper, yo? Yeah, other than uh, Nicki. You think he afraid to destroy him? It's probably just not his vibe. Yeah. He ain't lying there. It might not just be his vibe. Maybe tomorrow, though. <laughs> <laughs> um, what about 50 and his son, bro? That beef. That shit is crazy, man. That shit's ridiculous. Did you hear yeah. about that? Did you look up in that? Yeah, I, I've been saying it. I've been saying that shit. That shit, that shit been going on for years. I know he was paying more, like thirty bands a month for child support. Yeah, and his that's, baby. That's when. That's before he was eighteen, though. That shit been stopped. Yeah, I know, but his baby mama took him to court because it wasn't enough. Yeah, and this is what happened. Should have just left that shit alone. The bad magazine. <laughs>